Welcome to the vlog. Uh, it is currently night and I am hiking off to see an abandoned pond about two and a half miles away from me uh, here in Gatlinburg, almost on the outskirts. And even though it's cold enough for there to be ice, there are thousands of goldfish in this pond. So let's go. Uh, as some of y'all may know, fish is a huge hobby of mine. I love to learn anything about saltwater fish and freshwater fish. And growing up, I had like 20 tanks in the garage. Unfortunately, at this apartment, I can't have a fish tank, even though other people can, which makes absolutely no sense, but it's something I'm dealing with. Um, but let's head on over and check on our little guys, bring like, some bread to kind of I'm walking in downtown Gatlinburg, like I'm one street off, and this hotel has their laundry room propped open, and I'm going to get a drink. I mean, guess it takes two... And that is why I always bring change whenever I go out in Gatlinburg. Yeah, they might be throwing that out. That's a rickety as heck. Sweet. We got a Dr. Pepper. Thank you, Howard Johnson. Cheers. Somebody in the last five days since I've been here cleared all the brush out and it looks like a business has set all these wooden sculptures of like bald eagles and bears all over the place all around the pond and benches and cleared off the pond. <laughs> this is not good for me. So this was all wooded and everything brush had grown up over everything and now it's completely cleared oh my gosh there's a walkway the pond is still here but i wonder if they put chemicals in the pond okay some of their stuff's kind of cool this rooster bench is really cool we got the ninja turtles That's my breath. That's how cold it is out here. We don't want to scare the goldfish. And the reason why, it's very, very cold outside. And so they're conserving their energy by only moving what they need to breathe. If we scare them, they'll run out of energy and they'll die because they can't swim because they're out of energy. And it's really hard for goldfish to gain energy in really cold water. They're hardy. They'll stay alive even if the top of the water freezes. But they have to conserve their energy. Okay, so his art's cool. But, like, it messes up my spot. What the? Who's paying $2,500 for this? I mean, that's really cool, but I ain't paying $2,500 for that. This elk is really cool. But who's going on vacation to spend this much on wood? <laughs> 